And today is a blessed day. Look at the sky. Bihira lang magkaroon ng ganto sa Ireland. I'm gonna take you through my day, actually my night, because it's a night shift um, as an agency nurse. Hello, this is Emmanuel. Can I come in? Thank you. So yun nga guys, it's time to go home. But of course, iilip muna tayo sa hotel. And um, kakain muna tayo ng free breakfast. And then we'll go back to um, home. Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. Today is a different kind of vlog because uh, today is Saturday. Well, I'm gonna take you through uh, my my day, actually my night, because it's a night shift. It's a one hour drive and... Nasaan ka? Pakita ka. Hi guys. <laughs> it's 3.20 p.m. Ang shift ko uh, starts at 7. Um, but we're checking in. Para makatulog ako. So that I won't drive, uh, you know, after work without any slaha. Uh, para hindi masyadong dangerous kasi it's a long it's still a long drive 1 hour and 10 minutes is a long drive so it's still risky after a night shift mahirap mag-drive so yun nga parang under the agency and then whenever wherever there are shifts na like yun sa area nyo kunyari for example ICU or sa kanil ng trabaho sa theater um, kunyari merong near within the county or outside the county yun sasabihan kayo na agency if pwede nyo gawin yung shift sometimes pwede nyo ano, ahead of time but sometimes, pwede rin naman, like, a um, few hours before um, the shift, pwede kayong ano, contactin. So it really depends kung anong available. So yun nga guys, the good thing about doing agency shifts is that pwede kayong hindi mag-work kung talagang hindi nyo feel. Pero pwede naman kayong sunod-sunod kumuha ng shifts kapag sinisipag kayo with a better pay uh, compared to your regular staff nurse job. So it really depends upon your priorities. Hello mga guys, I'm ready to go to the hospital. It's a 70 minute drive so it's not too long of a drive. So it's 6.35 p.m. So pagdating to the hospital, I'm going to change to, uh, to my scrub suits and then I'm going to, to go to the handover room to receive handover from the outgoing uh, charge nurse. And then I'm, after 15 minutes, I'm going to the bedside um, to my patient allocation, which is one patient. And then I'm going to receive that over from the bedside nurse. Um, yeah, so that's it. And it's going to be a long night, so let's go. Hello, this is Emmanuel. Can I come in? Thank you. Thank you. I'm so I assess na ako ng pasyente ko, nag-assess na ako ng room ko, and then um, nag-assess ako ng pasyente. System-wise, from neuro to respiratory to cardio to cardiac to gastro, skin, pressure areas, ganun. Tapos, um, kinausap ko yung on-call na doctor uh, about the plan for tonight. Nag-restart ako ng feeding, nagbigay ako ng mga meds, uh, nag-start ako ng uh, night sedation. Um, IV and PO night sedation and then head to toe assessment ko sa computer nag-change ako ng central line dressing ano pa ba? yun lang naman nag-change ako ng dressing sa tracheostomy that's it that's what I did before I did my break and now after this we're gonna do the turns the road uh, the turns for the patients so after this break meron ulit na break na mas matagal like one hour break para pwede kayo matulog and, and you know pwede kayo mag-relax taas yung paa nyo or tatamiga kayo somewhere pwede naman so of course, very important the five moments of hand hygiene always nila you know, observe yan. So let's not forget to do it. Dito naman guys, next start na ang long break. So pang third break ako, kailangan kong i-relieve yung nurse beside me with a level 3 patient din and I'm trying to keep myself awake. Dito naman guys, I'm still looking after the two patients. I'm just making sure the ET tube stays in. Medyo nagsistruggle na ako, imulat ang mga mata ko, pero fight pa rin. They're both uh, stable, so it was okay. Actually, itong shift na to is, it was a grand shift. Walang admissions, walang emergency. Guys, kakatapos ko lang mag-handover. Nagpapalit lang ako from scrubs to my um, clothes. I was so ready to go home. Hindi naman masyado napagod yung katuwang lupa ko. So, thank you po, Lord, for a good shift. So, yun nga, guys. Tapos na ang aking shift. Hello. Hi, sorry. Uh, would you be able to stop? Yes. Yeah, thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. 
So guys, hindi na ako nakapag-vlog after no first break. I was so tired and I was so uh, sleepy. So I said, I just, I'll just sleep. So, yeah, flat on bed ako after that. And then when I woke up uh, around six o'clock, I had to do my medications. I have to get, I have to do bloods, and I have to, you know, do the final bits of documentation. So it's a bit hectic from six to seven, because seven is the handover time. So I have to be ready. <sighs> so you know, guys, it's time to go home. But of course, we eat And we eat a free breakfast. And then we'll go back to um, home. So, another hulug um, na naman sa and everything. <laughs> and um, yeah, so ganun lang boy dito sa abroad. Kung gusto mong kumita ng mas marami, the more uh, overtime, the more extra shifts, the more chances of winning. Um, so guys, I'm gonna use my phone for navigation, so I need to. Um, kailangan ko muna kayo i-let go and we'll talk later um, kapag nasa hotel na ako and kapag uuwi na ako and I'll let you know how this um, this day ends Hello guys, welcome back um, It's a wonderful morning today It is um, What time is it now? It's 10.34 in the morning so dumating ako dito sa hotel na mga 8.30 and then I tried to sleep um, so thank God nakatulog ako from, from 8.30 to 9.30 and then we went down for breakfast um, it's a free breakfast so it's better to take advantage of the <laughs> free breakfast pero pare-parehas lang naman yung mga free breakfast sa hotel dito and then today is a blessed day look at the sky bihira lang magkaroon ng ganto sa Ireland it's a good day to drive back home kasi sobrang maaraw init warm so um, I cannot complain so I'm very um, lucky today for, for those who watch this vlog thank you for watching and I know this is a different kind of vlog. This is not the usual vlogs that I make, um, but just to have something you know different and to try something new. And for those also who are kind of curious on how you know we do things here um, on this side of the world, nursing wise, um, and how Filipinos thrive um, abroad, pano magkaroon na extra income and ilang. So hopefully uh, you enjoyed watching this as well and hopefully you, you learned something from this or you got something from this vlog thank you guys for watching this vlog episode i'll see you guys on my next vlogs and if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet please do subscribe um lick the like lick oh my god lick um, press the like button give this th give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to hit the subscribe button so that Manu notify kayo if I have new videos uh, uploaded already. So, good luck sa mga nurses na nagbabalak po sa abroad, magwork sa abroad, anywhere, mabuhay tayo lahat. Sorry, And if you have any comments or suggestions on what you want to, what you want to see on this channel as well, please don't um, hesitate to put it down in the comment section below. Um, I read the comments and I reply to them as much as I can if, if I'm able to help somebody through those comments I'll gladly do so without further ado thank you so much and hope to see you guys on my next vlogs this is your um, Filipino nurse in Ireland Nurse Ventura at your service um, until next time goodbye na lang mag intro Intro mo. <laughs> Recording na ba yan? Hindi ko kasi alam saan ako dito. Dito, dito, dito. Saan na yung intro mo? Hindi ako maraming mag-entry. Hahaha! <laughs>